Hi there, Victor Kiros with Prudential California here. Today I'd like to talk a little bit about the HAFA program. Now, maybe some of you have seen information on the news or maybe on the internet or even newspapers regarding the HAFA program, but let me break it down for you a little bit more. The HAFA program started by the federal government April 5th of 2010. HAFA actually stands for Home Affordable Foreclosure Alternatives. Now, there's three ways that they can work the HAFA program for the borrower. Number one is mortgage modification, and it is very similar to what they've been doing in the past, but what they'll do is they'll give you a trial period. It might be three months, it might be six months, it might be a full year. Now, anybody who's granted a trial modification, if they default any time during that trial period, the mortgage modification will be rescinded and the borrowers will have to face uh, another choice. Either short sell your property, let it go to foreclosure, or do the deed in lieu of foreclosure. Now, the HAFA program also helps people who are doing short sales. The biggest difference between a HAFA short sale and a traditional short sale is the timing and $3,000 in relocation money. So back in 2008, 2009, we did a short sale and it might take six to seven months for the loan servicer to approve the short sale and get everything moving. In the meanwhile, the homeowner is left wondering what's going to happen. They're left in the dark. They're not sure if their property is going to foreclose or not. Well, with a half a short sale, rest assured, within 30 days, you'll have a response from your bank whether the short sale is going to be approved or not. And if it is approved, the borrower, the person doing the short sale, gets $3,000 in relocation funds to move after the property has closed escrow. And the last way the HAFA program might be able to help you is with the deed in lieu of foreclosure. If you don't want to do a short sale, you don't want to do a modification, provide the paperwork to the bank that HAFA requires and give the property back to the bank. That's called a deed in lieu. But listen, I do have here a HAFA flow chart. It talks to you about all the different ways HAFA can help you or somebody that you know. And this is directly from the federal government here, and I have this for free. If you'd like a copy of the HAFA flowchart, please get in contact with me. My website is victorforhomes.com. Feel free to call me. Feel free to email me. And I'll go ahead and email or fax this flowchart over to you, free of charge, of course. Now, if you know of anybody else who might need my services, in conducting a half a loan modification or short sale, please feel free to contact me. We always like to give out referral money, and hopefully that broke down half a just a little bit more for you. But if you want more details, go to my website, victorforhomes.com, click on the links, half a, and read all about it. Thank you very much for your time, and hopefully you see you soon. Take care.